guys, it's Missy Jones, and today's video is going to be. <laughs> today's video is going to be another hashtag school race video. So, if you don't know what school race is, school race is a place I started around two years ago, and it's it doesn't have many videos on it, but it's definitely some enjoyable videos apart from my old ones. <laughs> um. But it has some enjoyable videos on them and you can just laugh at my cringy old videos. So, even though I'm still cringy, with that in mind, if you haven't seen my channel before, please subscribe. I know my name is weird. My name is Grace Lee Jones and I would love if you could hit that subscribe button. And I make, on this channel, I make lifestyle, comedy, sketches expectation versus reality, makeup, fashion and beauty sort of things and if I was you, watch for the bloopers at the end of the video there might just be one but it's a bit funny without further ado, this video is a natural makeup for school video you can get away with this if you're not allowed to wear makeup and if you are, something just a bit simple but covers like all the blemishes. and if you're not allowed, if you wear minimal makeup, this is the makeup video for you so just keep on watching so i'm gonna start off just putting my hair back i think i'm just gonna talk about youtube while i'm doing this not general like alicia marie and stuff like that i'm just gonna talk about like my channel so i'm just tying my hair back just so oh my hair's not my way not if they look like i have dark circles under my eyes because they're not I had some makeup on, I just took it off just so I could film this video. And I have scored like less than, like, less than how long? Like, less than a month. Like, maybe two and a half weeks. I'm so excited. Like, no one's excited to go back to school apart from me. <laughs> Comment down below if you are one of the. I got really bad, like. <laughs> Comment down below if you are one of the small amount of people that love going back to school. For a certain reason or just because of school supplies. So I'm starting, I'm going to prime my face with, oh my, I need to get a new one of these soon because I use it quick. I'm going to prime my face with the Flawless Brightening Primer. And this is, the Flawless Primers are from Barry M. And yeah, I don't think you see. But basically, these primers brighten your skin and they are so, it's, it feels really nice. Like, it doesn't like feel disgusting. Like, so, yeah. So I'm just going to put it on my chin and then just work my way up. Thanks to James Charles, I learned, oh gosh I put a lot on there, I learned never put it on your nose. Because if you put it on your nose it makes like all the makeup on your nose slide off because it's like a thin surface and it doesn't dry. Definitely put I I might look like I'm putting it on my nose but I'm not, I'm not really going like that. So. I don't have an eye primer just really because I don't have like eyeshadow on that long. Like sometimes my eyeshadow, I'll just, I'll just take my eyeshadow off and just have face makeup because face makeup looks a bit ridiculous on me when I literally don't have. Because oh, I'm pretty young and yeah. <laughs> I've decided, like, I've made up a slogan for me because I used to get like so much hate because. I used to get so much hair because um, I used to like, like I still do like use put so many disclaimers in. It's just because of the amount of hair that I get. So I'm like, I'm not saying like I'm famous or anything. Like definitely not. I'm just saying there's a lot of hair out of how much I have. And yeah, but obviously I don't put this on all the time. I'm literally actually probably going to end up wearing like zero makeup for school because we're not allowed to wear makeup, but people still wear it. And I think it's just going to be like eyebrows and the way I do the eyebrows in this tutorial so yeah please don't hurt I said last time your comments won't be will be removed but I've decided I'm not going to remove them anymore you'll be reported and blocked and that's about it because I want people to see I don't want people to see that everyone likes my things you know what I mean you can you're allowed to have an opinion like oh this video was all right but I like the rest of your vid like this video was wasn't one of, one of the best videos you've made how about you try this? Like, give me options, basically. By the way, I'm just using the Mint Dew Lips lip scrub. Yeah, I'm just going to leave it on for a little bit while my primer's, like, setting in. By the way, this is vegan and so... 
Like, I love the idea of it, basically. So I'm just gonna let this go into my lips, like soak in, and let my primer soak in, because then I'll just lick it off, because I'm pretty sure that's what you meant to do with lip scrubs. <laughs> it says mint chocolate without the lip chip. It's what you get with the tasty sugar lip buffer. So I'm just gonna leave this on. I need to buy so many more brushes, so let's just wait for me to this soak the skin up. So let's soak up. Right, so I feel like it's soaked into my skin. I'm sorry for this lie, like, <laughs> like, excuse me. I'm trying to film a video here. So, yeah, who cares about this lie? We're gonna carry on. Um, So I'm just gonna lick it off. Right, now I've licked it off, I feel like this is quite soaking into my skin. And you might think like, Grace, you know, I'm gonna like, let it soak into your skin. My makeup literally slides off through this one, but it's so good. It is brightening, it makes my face look good, it makes my face look glowy. I I like matte makeup, but some makeup I like, like, dewy. So a lot of these, like, sort of natural things are from, like, drugstore brands. So, because all my other makeup, like, some of my other makeup is a bit fancy, some isn't. And when I say fancy, I'm not talking about, like, <laughs> Chanel. I'm just talking... I have like some Urban Decay, like I literally have like like a few Urban Decay things. Um, I'm not gonna use my fancy Urban Decay all night thing because I just have like the sample one, that's pretty good. And I have some MAC, but like I'm not gonna use all of the stuff I got, like all my new stuff because it's some of it is a bit. Oh gosh, I can't even see it on how much I'm putting on. Oh, this is scary. Got like a little like dirty mirror set up, but who cares? All right, now I'm gonna pop a little more. I forgot to tell you what it is. It's the Mabel Maybelline Super Stay 24 Hour Foundation. I feel like Maybelline, if you put like normal amount on, like quite like a little amount on, it's a bit like <laughs> they're a bit like it makes it look yellowy. Like seriously, yeah. Sometimes I used to like kick it on a little when I first got it. Oh my gosh, I was so like disgusting. It was just loads. Like of, it looked like cakes basically. It was disgusting and it looked yellow. Now it like it looks decent. All right, so I'll just swipe a bit under my jaw on my jawline because it's not like much of a difference. So I'm just gonna get my things, beauty sponge, beauty blender, whatever you wanna call it. I used to get hit on like I used to call these like little things beauty blenders just because i didn't actually know what the meaning of a beauty blender was like, you know, in my old makeup collection i thought the meaning of a beauty blender was like like it's something for beauty and it blends stuff so i just initially used my brain my common sense but oh, my common sense didn't get me very far um so basically now i know what it was now, now i know what it is it's like a, a brand of one but like i call this my beauty blender just because in general, it's like a beauty sponge or a beauty blender. I really don't care. Like some YouTubers call them beauty blenders, some don't. So right now, I'm just putting in my foundation. I use a dabbing technique. Oh my gosh, this looks so. I use a dabbing technique, and I have a skin on like here is so much light compared to the rest of my face. So I think I'm I'm just gonna fast forward the rest of me doing my foundation. Right, so my make my foundation might look disgusting right now, just blatantly because 
I have some darker bits right now because I'm wearing like random spots of tan and it's really frustrating me. Like it's not even it's not even sunny. Like why? Like but moving on. That was my foundation. And I've put like a light cover on like usually when there's too much unless I'm disgusting. I've already washed my hands before and I've just put my ha hand in Garnier my cellar water, so it's fine. People, but I just like rub it in a little if there's like a little bit right there. We'll and before you guys all comment, you probably already have, but before you guys all comment, oh you're too young to do makeup, this is ruining your skin. I barely ever wear it. Right? You don't need f oh you don't need foundation. Yes, I understand I I really don't need foundation. I've heard this a lot in my life. Online and off on and offline. But this is an art for me. Like I know I'm not good at it. But right now this is like an art oh my gosh, that's the red. It feels like like an art to me. I I'm enjoying doing it. Like I've literally done it twice a day already. But yeah. But I'm just gonna put it under my eyes. So, I'm just going to do this with my inner corner using this side and this side. I don't know what side I'm going to use, but I really don't care right now, so yeah. So, please subscribe if you are just watching this. Like, my channel really is subscribing. Like, I'd love if you could, like, tell your friends, tell your family, tell your dog, tell your dog's cousin, tell your neighbour. Tell your parents. But then obviously, family friendly channel. <laughs> Apart from, like, don't give, like, I give little kids ideas when it comes to. <laughs> I really like my. Today my stomach's, like, just been rumbling all day, and I'm like, not today. Not today. Right? I've got my earrings in because my earrings are, like, not going because I didn't put my earrings in for ages. So my ears are really thick, if you realise. Like, it looks massive right now. It's just swollen. My beauty blender or beauty sponge is really, 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 like, <laughs> disgusting right now. So, please ignore it. It's clean. It just stained. So, but I'm literally not, like, getting, like, snot out or anything. Uh, I'm just dabbing in where that I have a little scratch, which is just under my nose. Right now, let's see what my skin looks like. My skin is very furry, so it sticks out, so it won't look like this one, like disgusting on your skin. It's just my skin is generally disgusting, but like far away. Oh yeah, and I get them on. My, I get the bumps on my face because I just get them all over my body. Like it's really weird. Anyway, moving on, this is my face. Um, I <laughs> look cake right now. But don't worry, that's just because I haven't got the rest of my makeup on. Right. So now we finished with concealer and dabbing that in. Wow, that took forever. This video is probably just going getting really long right now. So I do like a lot of like setting spray at times. So this is my revolution. Um, Pro Fix Eliminating Fixing Setting Spray. Fixing Spray, which is a setting spray technically, in terms. So I'm just gonna do this, like, close my mouth right now. Right. I get shocked if I send it here. Right, here we go. Oh no, when I do this, my skin gets all furry because it's not like my foundation isn't setting right now, so my foundation gets furry. And if I wiped it, like it would look disgusting, so I just need to let it dry. So I'll catch you guys in a bit. So I'm back, and my foundation still looks a bit uh, furry just because I don't know how to say furry, it's really weird. I have like furry skin, but it just looks a bit furry just because I've just put that setting spray on. Like it basically looks a bit like. Disgusting. Like it looks like it's been swiped <laughs> along my face. Anyway, I forgot to explain which concealer this is. I haven't had this for long, and look how much it's gone down. Like, uh. this is the Maybelline New York Instant and Age the Eraser Eye. So this 
say I got. If you've realised, on this hand I have zero nails. On this hand I've got a lot of nails. Ugh. Right, anyway, like you guys care about that. Moving on. So I'm just going to get my... I'm just going to... Oh my gosh, look at that excess powder. Usually, like I bake... Mm, not today. Because I want to do a natural look. And recently I've been baking too much. Like a good amount. So I'm just getting the access off. I don't want a lot. I'm just going to literally rub my mom because who cares? I need a shower. Anyway, like, I don't know what that is. I'm, I'm going to go into somewhere. Is that this? I was like, wow, I need deodorant. I know it's so disgusting, but do I? I really need deodorant. And I put it on, don't I? Because I really need a shower. Oh my gosh, why are you going? I have like eczema, so I thought it looks like I'm not scratching my like, armpit, armpit. <laughs> I'm just scratching my skin um, because I have eczema, so. Right, I don't know if there's anything on there yet. So I'm going to use the Rimmel London Instant Fix. It's just right on me. Who cares? I'm in, I'm in like clothes. Like, I wear, never wear those. Like, I'm in lazy clothes, right? So, this is the hashtag Insta Fix and Matte Translucent Powder from Rimmel London. And it's just a panned powder. This is like all over my hand right now. Like, can you see this? Right. Uh, right, here we go. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna put it on my skin and rub it in. Right. I'm not gonna put it everywhere. I'm just gonna put it in the spots where I've, like, like, kind of need to conceal. I end up like slightly. I'm just gonna not bake, bake. I'm just gonna put some under my eyes. Just like a really small amount, just because I just want it to be a bit highlighted and just make sure it's definitely set. And I'm just gonna powder there. And I powdered there. Now it's just like, I know it's like a weird pass because I basically put stuff on there as well. Yeah, whatever. So I'm now just gonna right, get this, all this powder off. The access powder. Right. Right, here we go. I need my like, eyebrows done. Oh my gosh. I, I get them like slightly waxed. Like, you can't say anything because it's not like I'm doing anything really inappropriate. Cause I'm just getting my eyebrows waxed. But like, it's not much even. It's just like, because I have a natural shape, apparently, it's just like these little bits here that I get really done and then I'm like finished. Oh my gosh. Uh, I have hair in my eyes. But I don't know where it's coming from. Right, never mind. Let's keep on going because. Right, and let's entertain you. Um, I am so happy I got to go to Swimming City. I'm so sorry I'm not going next year. I probably already mentioned that, but like. I'm really happy I had the chance to. And it was really good fun. Right, so my face is powdered. I look like a ghost. Just because I need to get all this other stuff on. So I rarely ever wear blush, but when I do, I wear I wear the Kiko Shade Fusion in number three trio blush. Like look at this. Like this used to be like this is the best mirror, but like this mirror makes my skin look awful, so uh, so I'm just gonna get my Rose and Inks blush brush. <laughs> and this is massive for this. I'm just gonna just get like a good swipe on all colours. I'm not a big fan of 
I'm basically not much of a fan of. Uh, I am not a massive fan. I can't remember. Basically, I'm not a massive fan. Like, I don't blow in. Never mind. By the way, I, you know how I said I was thinking of a slogan? I totally forgot to tell you. Every time I think, every time I say a slogan, I think of Logan Paul. And I, I'm so not into this drama thing. So, if people want to leave the deets down below and tell me exactly what went on with Logan Paul, Jake Paul, whoever it was, I totally don't mind. I know I'm putting a lot of brush on because this one I'm just getting like the perfect thing. There we go. I'm not putting bronzer on just mainly because I'm going to school and I'm not going to be contouring but I'm going to put oh my god oh my god oh I'm so sorry I said that word but I just said like the D O U I I just don't want to like I'm not exactly um religious I just didn't want I'm not religious I just didn't want in that way I'm not really basically I'm not religious in that way I just didn't don't want to offend anyone who is Christian or Catholic or whoever. So, Super Drug have brought an elf. I basically, I just like went like that and swiped it off and then he fell on the ground and about got caught in my lap. Super, Super Drug have in, introduced elf cosmetics. Oh my gosh. In stores. It's in so many. I think it's in quite a few stores right now. My gosh. I love this highlighter. Put it on wrong. She, lo like, she looks so good. And I put on my other highlighter and I was like, right, that's going on me. I still have so much excess highlighter. I'm just going right, to put a nat natural swipe down there. But like, it's hard, like, you, you might just be oily. No, like, the teacher could literally just think you're a really oily person. But then other folks would be like, yes, the highlighter is amazing. It is Popping. Trying to catch this on and I get the perfect thing. I'm so much, I'm, I'm so much better of doing highlighter and not just on my like on my muscle one. Like I'm better at doing highlighter on other people than actually myself. I've got that. I've got my highlighted game strong and I'm just going to put it on my cupid's ball. That is the cupid's ball. Like I used... Uh, yeah. Whew. And this will just like go during the day. Like by the time you get to school, it probably won't be from there anymore. But it's worth a shot. Right. So, that was the L. Whew. I actually put a sweat on just because I literally think I was going to break. I don't know what the packaging is, it's just elf bronzer in Moonlight Pearls. Ha elf highlighter in Moonlight Pearls. I literally thought it was going to break. Oh my god, that was stressful. Moving on to eyebrows. So right now, whoa, my highlighter game is strong. I'm just going to put on the Gimme Brow, little mini Gimme Brow. And I'm running out and it's in shade 1 because... This was my mom's, and then she got a big one, and then she didn't need it, and then she never used it. So I was like, yeah, I'll take it. I have a lot of makeup with my mom, and but like, she has some good stuff, and so do I. So yeah, it's like a little thing. Like, for going out, I just wear, put this on. Like, this is how I'll have my eyebrows to school, like, literally. But for going out, like, literally just go out, like, any day, like, <laughs> I don't know, park, beach, whatever. I just, sorry, the light changed, by the way. I just put this on, mascara, a little bit of MAC, in, um, paint pot in Indian wood, which is, like, a bronzy shade. And then I put velvet chili on, because I'm basic. And, yeah, that's what I do. So now, this is actually, you might think this is disgusting, right? But I use this, what I do is, and then I put like water in my palm, right? Just put my cellar water in my palm. Oh. So, what I do is, I'll just, just 
liquid on there just to get like all the excess stuff on. Just put water in my palm. This video is so long, it's like literally like 40 minutes, but I'm tying up some of this stuff. So now I've put it on my palm. This is clean ish at least. I'm just gonna style, shape my eyebrows whilst just setting them. Because I saw this hack and I was like, yes, no one's got time or money to buy a set. So, but people are, but like. <laughs> I haven't. Right. This just makes them a bit bigger, and I'm keeping like they're like big right now. So what I'm gonna do is, um, either you can leave them like this, and you can literally leave just your full face, and this is like your your makeup. Or if you want to take this to extra level, just keep on watching. So I'm going to prepare my lips with some mint julep lip scrub from Lush again. And this highlighter is like Lush. Like this highlighter. Lush. Haha. <laughs> puns. Puns. And this highlighter is like really nice. It's just like so glittery. Like I'm like. Oh my gosh. How much highlighter did I put on? I didn't notice until the sun came out. I'm so sorry the sun came out. But like. But yeah. You could literally just leave it look like this. And with that lip scrub on here. Obviously. I need to talk clearer. Um, so I'm just gonna get the natural collection from Boots. Like everything's like two pound. I'm just gonna get this waterproof mascara. Yeah, this is fragrance free, by the way. Just to tell you. So you can either you could leave it like it was before, or you could just go there. Uh, make sure it's not clumpy though, because my eyelashes are always clumpy. <laughs> and just pop out. Three light coats, unless it's a clump, which it is for me. Three light coats. Oh my god. Of three light coats of mascara, unless you want like, a little bit more. If you're allowed to wear makeup, I don't know what your case is. So now I'm just gonna lip lick my lips to go off. It's on the floor, mascara, who cares? Right, I do. And um, here's my new MAC lipstick. I got it from Summer in the City. I got it. not from Summer in the City. I got it at after Summer in the City. So it I got it like on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. What time is it? Oh, yes, it's quarter past six. Family fizz. Ah, I met family fizz. I'm so happy. Sorry. Oh my gosh. Ah, I'll do like a summer in the city experience video. Anyway, this is a new Mac lipstick that I got, and it's in the frost lipsticks, and it's a bronze shimmer. So obviously, this is like a lot. Like you see this? This can actually come out this color if color <laughs> if you put enough on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna. You can even do puff velvet teddy on whatever you want. I'm just gonna go throw it all there a bit. If you didn't realise, I like a bit of a shimmer or like glitter, whatever you want to call it. So, this is. Sorry about that. This is my natural makeup tutorial. So, oh, let's get to the outro. So, this is my natural makeup for back to school i hope you guys enjoyed this back to school video sorry it wasn't a sketch or anything like that i know this i literally am filming this video two weeks before school and this is going up four days before school four days at least i hope it has so hopefully this is just the first of september video and by the way if you guys if you didn't know i've just started posting videos every week i used to be not on a like roll at all i am now posting videos every week um i've just remembered that i could have put my i was gonna put eyeshadow on for my naked basics palette which you could also add that i just really thought this look looked fine as it is so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i love you guys all so much and i just want to say thank you for being part of this family with me and get excited for next friday's, friday's video which hopefully will be another back to school vi video but i've already been back to school and I will be talking to you about a certain subject.
my first day of school. Hopefully, my first day of school experience. So hopefully, if I am a good person, I would have done this already because I'm pre-recording this. I love you so much. You are beautiful and goodbye. <laughs> and I've decided I've made up a new soul. Seriously, can the stomach should help mine. Can you see the green block? Guys, it's Rosie Jones, and today's video is going to. Oh my god.